Okay, a helpful tip when you're installing a, a T-nut for your sketch easel. So here's a stack of uh, Raven uh, sketch easels. Here's the, the bottom of, of, of a Raven. And um, you can see how that base is glued and screwed uh, to the platform base. And this is your, your T-nut base. And you can see there's where the, where the, uh, the quick plate for your tripod's gonna screw into. So one of the mistakes I've seen uh, guys do is they'll install their T-nut like that and then they'll glue it in or hammer it into the wood and then they'll attach this to the base of their sketch easel and that's wrong. I mean that's just going to eventually pull right out of there. Um, you know there's no amount of glue or, or hammering. Uh, that you can do to make it so this T-nut's going to securely stick to the base of this platform. The trick is you want it to be you want it to be like installed like that so it's hammered in and it's pulling squeezing the wood in between the T-nut and your quick plate and then you attach this like I have here, to your base of your sketch easel. If you want your sketch easel to work on your tripod, that's important that you get that, that construction uh, part correct. You'll notice this is a T-nut with three prongs. They also come in four. I like three because I don't want to drill four holes if I don't have to, but you'll notice I've drilled pilot holes for these little prongs to go into. And then I can just Put it in there. And that thing is not going anywhere. It's in there, it's countersunk. And I'm gonna screw into that right there. Tip of the day for you.